we were on stage when the Beatles came to the Peppermint Lounge. And we knew they were coming in advance. The club was maybe a third full. As soon as the word was out that the Beatles were coming, it packed. There was standing room only. You couldn't even get in the club. They were lined up outside. So we wanted to do something for them because at that time, the bands, the entertainers, and all of them, they didn't really accept the Beatles. The Beatles weren't really, they were f foreigners to them. You know, they, that's just something all new. So we did a tribute to the Beatles when they walked in and they thought that was pretty, pretty neat. We did it with our horns and our guitars. So they actually waited to meet us till we took a break. So we were able to talk to them a little bit, meet them and chat with them a little bit. Brian Epstein said, absolutely no photographs. And uh, Ringo intervened and said, oh, eh, take a picture of this. That's okay, take this one. We um, actually had a chance to go a little further with them, but contract negotiations and things didn't work out. We were thought we were pretty good at that time too.